sorry guys. My camera fell out. All right guys, once I got back in the video, we're gonna play WWE 2K16, uh, 2K Shuriken Arsene G60, um, because that game is the best. So, I wanna show you guys the gameplay. So we're gonna go to 2K Showcase. And then, I think, I think that's it guys, I think. I'm not sure, but I have to be quiet. So, this is the 2K Showcase. You hit that? Okay, look, I can't go up with this story right now. Alright, I'm gonna try 2K Showcase, just listen. Showcase. A stage to display one's talents. From the unforgettable moments. This is home. That is home, bro. Stage. It's a lot to home. To the greatest conflicts. Ooh. From the biggest names. But this showcase is about a man. Despite his success, no one saw a superstar. And when injuries sidelined Steve, the future looked bleak. The next day I got a FedEx announcement and I was fired. I was like, that kind of sucked. Frustration took over. There's nothing going my way because the politics kept the biggest potential superstar in wrestling on the ground. Frustration turned to anger. We're going to put the U.S. title on you, and then we're going to take you here, and then you're the number one contender, so then you got this world title shot. Well, all that's ever happened. And the anger created opportunity. The ringmaster seems to oh. really have it all. The size, the strength, the agility, the wrestling acumen. Austin would enter WWE as the ringmaster, but wasted no time turning himself into a more ruthless character. His peers got him the ringmaster. I would suggest you would look on his moment was finally here. It's on the bigger and better things after King of the Ring, after I win it all. And nothing would be the same again. I think I see this. Oh, Jim, I think Jim was and I think um, Jerry the King lost it, I think. Oh, look, look, look. I'm not sure. Oh, here we go. Welcome to 2K Showcase. Austin 360. Oh, yeah, the game is so slow. I know. I have to be, um, Jake the Snake. Yeah, I think. Whoa. Can you... Bro, why just go for the same in a day, bro? Come on, bro. Oh, here we go. Alright, we're going to okay, go for the same boss. Alright, we're going to see Jay or Jake the Snake. Let's see if he's going to get hurt, bro. Let's go. All right, ladies and gentlemen, the King of the Rings, Stone Cold Steve Austin awaits that man 
And King, that man tipped the Snake Roberts earlier tonight, took on Vader. No, it was not a good outing for the Snake. Oh, yeah, the one. The four ways with one. Watch this thing. Vader Bob. Ooh. It's a free spot left in the ring. 450 pounds doing internal damage. To what degree, we don't know. But Jake Roberts struggling, struggling to even get his, his rip tie up, his rip tie yeah. back up on the apron of the ring. And Jake changes it. Come on, come on, bro. This is a one-small match. It's a oh, yeah. No, that's it. And the rattlesnake. Showing us that he up. is wanting to end this quickly and convincingly. Oh, look at this, JR. What's he doing to him? He's uh, stopping a mud hole and take the snake, and now he is walking and dry. Nothing but high impact intensity from a relentless, unforgiving stone from Steve Austin. He's pounding poor Jake the snake like a tent snake. No stopping the rattlesnake here. Austin is not going to give any opportunity for Jake Roberts to find his way back into oh. this match. Nothing pretty about oh, Austin's shit. offense. Oh, it's shoot. very effective. Oh, man, here goes. Oh. Austin up the right. second turnbuckle, driving his elbows into the sternum, the ribs of Jake the Snake Roberts. Uh, the corner. Oh, wait, we got my lock. Hey. We got a lock. Wait, Jerry the King? You see? Alright. Let me go check. I'm not sure. Come on. Come on, Jack the, the snake. Come on. Alright, go. I love this game so much. Alright, I'm gonna. Um, and that'll give you a negative attitude. Well, the hell sometimes when you get outside the ring of survival, the match becomes a uh, uh, dangerous objects. That work belongs inside the ring. Oh, cool. We simply got to applaud the courage of both these warriors, folks. Yeah, both of these warriors that you call it. <laughs> take to the hospital. Oh, my God. And now both are back battling here. Oh, heck no. Get off of me! Oh, I know her. Oh, yeah, I know her. I know her. <laughs> oh! Let's go! Let's go. Right. Right in the corner. Woo! Oh, hey, no. Oh, hey! Oh, wait, I'm 
person. Oh, fuck. Oh, heck no. Heck no. I right, come on. Who's gonna miss it? Just get him out of the ring, get him out of the WWE. Because I've proved, son, without a shadow of a doubt, you ain't got what it takes anymore. You sit there and you thump your Bible and you say your prayers and it didn't get you anywhere. Sit. Talk about your Psalms, talk about John 316. Austin 316 says I just whipped your ass. Ooh! And heck yes, Coco. All he's got to do is go buy my cheap bottle of whiskey. Buy a big box of that tourist he had in his pride. It's the king of the ring. I'm serving notice to easy. every one of the WWE superstars. I don't give a damn what they are. They're all on the list. And that Stone Cold's list. I'm fixing to start running through all of them. Heck yeah. And as far as this championship match is considered, son, I don't give a damn if it's Davey Boy Smith or Shawn Michaels. Steve Austin's time has come. And when I get the shot, you're looking at the next WWE champion. And that's the bottom line because Stone Cold said so. Hell yeah. Obviously, anything but humble. The fourth prestigious king of the ring, Stone Cold Steve Austin. Hey right, guys, let's see what it's here while we're all lock. Hey, we all lock. Austin 316 says I just whipped your ass. It's the king of the ring. I'm serving notice to every one of the superstars. They're all on the list. I'm fixing to start running through all of them. Right, you want this too long? Two rounds. What? Alright, you guys. I'll see you guys on part two. I'll see you guys on part two. 2K Sharkin Austin 360. And the way 2K 19. Alright. Peace out.